Yes, sir. Sir, I still have a report. Yes. This is what needs to be done. This is being addressed. You are talking about the report. I'm talking about what is here on, 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 on sir, the Sir, you have noted. We are happy with it. Can you get away from this meeting now? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. He doesn't understand the problem, so he, he, he can't help me. Look at look at look at this look at this ground. He's talking about a report. Huh? It is not fair. Look at this. If you are just in front here, you will think the school is alright. But we must ensure that all the children are in an environment that is suitable for them. I have also noticed that my field officers, especially the lower level of my field officers, only follow me when I come to inspect schools. And uh, we are going to act very swiftly to ensure that everybody, it doesn't matter who you are, as long as you are being paid by the exchequer through taxpayers' money, that you work and inspect the schools. Otherwise, the situation we have seen at the back there, which I am coming to inspect in about two hours when I finish with the Eldoret Polytechnic, uh, it tells you that some of my people are sleeping on the job and we shall act on them. I don't deal with reports. I deal with measurable outputs. Now, if you have not been for seven months, why do you want to come when I'm coming myself? I don't need you. But having said all that, the main reason why I'm here this morning was just to check and confirm as part of the 100% inspection of the excellent work being done by our Juakali youth with regards to the 653,000 odd desks and that uh, you have confirmed yourselves that the quality of the product is good. Yesterday I was in Kirinyaga. By the end of next week, I have learned, regrettably, that a few unscrupulous officers are colluding with a few teachers to split the deliveries and to take some of the deliveries elsewhere. Without being specific, I want to warn them in public during daylight that every desk made shall go to the child in the public school at the school that was uh, anointed to receive the desks. Every desk must go to the school. We are not going to handle anybody with gloves. <coughs> so if you want to take the risk to steal from those children you have seen in the classroom, then you can be sure that your destination is to hell direct. We are not going to be sympathetic with you. <coughs> so for those teachers in Migori area, who together with some of my officers think that they are smarter than the government, I want to give them 24 hours to reverse the processes that they are trying to do and to ensure that the desks go to the appropriate schools that they were assigned to. Otherwise, 
we shall just proceed to arrest them. We are not going to argue with anybody. This is supposed to be economic stimulus package money. And since the Jokali people are doing a very ex uh, excellent job, we should not be the impediment. Blessed. Finally, I am disappointed. This is now the tenth time I'm saying, please keep distance. You have refused to keep distance, so you shall die. <laughs> please keep distance. This week I have lost Dr. Ajisi, I think you know Dr. Ajisi, who was uh, Mr. Sonko's uh, Minister for Health, Amanda. We lost Agneta Ouma at NEC, young and versatile, and very many others. There are very many VIPs, some of them now in hospital, some in ICU. Why do you, why do you think this is a joke? Please keep distance in whatever you are doing, because this disease has come here to stay. Finally, help us to tell the public to wear a mask. And when we wear a mask, don't wear it in the cheek. It's supposed to cover your nose and your mouth. Are we together? <coughs> then let me also say, this thing of kugotea, that you give me your hand like this, don't do it. Unagotea nini? Because in order to go there, you must come very close. So if you are one meter away, how do you go there? Are we together? Let me leave you with those and say that uh, I believe that.